I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch! Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' Yeah, I'm ballin', yeah, I'm ballin', been ballin' I'm winning, get buckets from the court side to the nosebleeds Yeah, they love it I'm winning, get buckets from the first in and the last out, see me coming. First take, I'm hotter than hot, hotter than some boiling water, I bubble the pot. Team full of ballers, baby, we winning a lot. I'm like Curry with the rock when I get to my spot. I'm tapping in, I'm passionate, this is what passion is. This here, nah, this is no accident. From the start to the finish, I'm cashing in. I am number one, not number two If I'm not the one, I'm uncomfortable See the competition I've been running through Leveled up, I only see him in my rear view Switch, yeah, I'm balling Welcome everyone to the house that Rotney built Notre Dame Stadium Underneath the watchful eye of Touchdown Jesus The home of the Fighting Irish Today we have one of those games that tests your focus Top 25 team against an unranked opponent. Can you take care of business? As we'll see a squad from the Sun Belt, the Appalachian State Mountaineers, taking on the 17th ranked team in the land, the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. For EA Sports College Football, my Bruce Davis joined here in the booth by David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. And guys, let's get this thing started. Make a play, David, and get this thing going. Yeah, let's find some juice. Find your guy. Find those plays that you know you can run inside out, forward, backwards. On second down, he'll fire. He'll take the deep shot. And a big play on the outside. What a job to keep those feet in bounds and get the completion. Decides to go for it on fourth down. Calls his own number. Brought to the ground. Looking for a path to the end zone to the right. And he'll glide his way in for the score. Touchdown, Notre Dame! That touchdown just got this whole place going. Well, look, you got everybody here in the Irish Bowl. Touchdown, Jesus is happy. You got the leprechaun, he's dancing. The energy in this place right now is on another level after that score. No wonder this is such a tough place to come in and try to get a win on the board. On third and long, you'll need to push it downfield. Tremendous awareness along the sideline and the ability to get the foot down for the big... They want to throw it. Trying to beat the D deep. Makes the grab. And he'll go out of bounds just short of the goal line, and they've got it right on the doorstep. Physical, be powerful. You saw last week he got a rushing touchdown. I look for... And he's going to take it to the house. This guy just has a nose for the end zone. You love his ability to find princes, use his speed in the open field, and go score. He's been really good for his offense early this year. That already his fifth rushing touchdown on the season. And it could get a little tricky fast. If you don't score here, if you don't possess the football and put something together to give your deep... Fires into traffic and intercepted. And they'll drag him down after a good return on the interception. Who says defensive backs don't have hands? Nice job breaking on the football and making the catch. A lot of times you see guys swat it down and you see them trying to catch it. It looks like they have two left hands. Defensive backs don't catch real well. Nice job breaking on the football. Nice job securing the INT and actually catching it. level and up 14 nothing David this is the exact start you want I mean offense is playing great defense has gotten stops you're in a position now Palmer to put the hammer down and get a three possession lead I'm got some room and to the goal line and he runs it in for the score touchdown Irish how efficient have they been as they extend this lead here in week five well this offense 
defense is top 10 in the country in points per game because they've got a lot of speed and they've got home run hitters. They score fast. They don't need 10 plays to go down the field. You saw it right there. They've recruited well. They've got playmakers. They're going to be a problem for defenses all year long. On second down, he'll let it fly. They get him up rush, and it pays off the sack at the 20. The defense coming up big there, and the sack is great, but the secondary deserves some credit, too. No doubt. When you can cover like that in the secondary and drop back in your zone and only rush a few, and you feel comfortable getting home, and they're going to get to the quarterback. Looking to throw, and he needs a bunch. And the defense gets loose, bringing the heat, and down he goes again. We haven't even gotten to halftime yet. This offense has their hands full trying to keep this quarterback standing up straight. They've already given up multiple sacks. That's the biggest reason why they're trailing by as much as they are. They better go in at halftime and make some big-time adjustments. They have been able to go out and execute, David. Yeah, and it's just maintaining the lead. Keep doing what you've been doing. you got a big lead. Let's just keep piling it on until they find an answer. On third down, he drops to throw. He'll take another shot here. And he makes the catch inside the 20. Touchdown, Notre And they add six more for that trip to the house. And coming into the game, you look at the stats, you say top 10 offense in scoring. So they better be able to create what? Explosive plays. Another explosive plays. They've been doing it all year long. Those plays are backbreakers. Defenses just can't contain this offense. Wants to throw on first down. Looking to the big tight end. Complete to the right. Ripping. Looking to pass on second down. Caught over the middle. It's Tucker. As this offense tries to find a way to draw a little closer. Bought a little time. Let's it go. Into the hallelujah land. Touchdown, Appalachian State. Man, nice job getting the passing game going. This, this is big, man. Going to the half, and listen, I know you're trailing, but building some momentum. Maybe this second half, we can keep airing the football out, cutting into this deficit, and who knows what the heck will happen. They'll run play action. He's not afraid to go deep. Makes the grab on the right. They finally make the stop, but that one will make those halftime stats look a little nicer as we head to the break. That's going to wrap up the first half here, and now we join Kevin with the halftime update. All right, guys, looks like we've got a great one in South Bend going on. And we have to start this halftime breakdown by addressing the play of this elite wide receiver. This is clearly a young man who, once he's finished playing on Saturdays, he's going to be playing on Sundays. The kid has different gears. He has a knack for finding gaps in the defense. And I can't remember a college player with that kind of catch radius. And with that, let's send it back to the home of the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. In the gun and looking to throw on third down. And the ball is intercepted. And after the interception and the turnover, this defense has set its offense up for business. I love when people start to understand what we're doing defensively. If they're going to pass the football and that's where they're going to live, well, I'm going to live and die. I'm going to bring more defensive backs on the field so I can cover more of these speed guys that they have out there. Great job by the defensive back. They're looking to pass from the red zone. into the second half. Man, it makes it easy, doesn't it? You start getting up by a couple possessions, making the offense very predictable on the other side. Great job by the offense extending their lead. He's looking to throw. Quick strike complete. Now they've got a little... 
looking to throw on second down. Going to try to pop one on the screen. And the defense able to short from the 45. He wants to throw it again. Can't make the connection. To the air on first down. Feeling some heat. And on third and long, no secret what he needs here. Unloads to the right. A strike downfield. And he's brought down after a huge completion. And this defense is going to have their hands. Quarterback checking off. On third down, he'll try to pick it up through the air. Wide open downfield. This offense, how about the defense? They've hung in there, Palmer, made him earn it all the way down. Now, are you going to go for it on fourth down? Yeah, you know, after running so many plays offensively on the drive, I know it'd be disappointing to only walk away with the field goal, but you'd feel even worse if you went for a touchdown and didn't get it. I think you kick it right here. Dropping back, it's Phillips. And they get to the quarterback and knock him down back at the 16. And how about this offense, man? It's been a rough day. You're getting beat down. You're trying to find some kind of momentum late in the game to build something off of, and you give up another sack. And heavy tackle on the tight end. And they'll send the field goal team back out for the second time tonight. Kick is good. The offense has three points to show for the drive. Well, that's just piling on. Not the penalty kind, just the mean kind. Yeah, there are very few teams out there that won't watch. And the pass rush is effective, and they tackle him at the 19. The defense puts the exclamation point on the day. They have had a wonderful day, man, doing everything great. Just You could tell they were dialed into what was going on, and now just throw another sack in the equation, hitting the quarterback, being disruptive. They've been all over the field. This offense needs to go out and protect him. Yeah, they've been the more physical team all game long. So let's just run the ball. Let's just ice this football game. Take the W into the locker room. When you know you have a team outclassed, the ability to play to that standard and finish with a blowout like this is really impressive. And it's almost like playing against yourself, right? You know you're better. You know you're going to win the football game. But how do I continue to still execute? This, this was so easy. Great execution. Uh, just beat down in every facet. I think as a player, you just love being in such great rhythm. And we saw that right from the get-go in this game. Offense just able to matriculate the ball down the field. Defense was not giving anything up. What a great game plan coming in. And this was just total domination.